therapy for varicose veins really involved ligation and stripping, which was very painful and bothersome for patients. These were in the OR, patients were you know, put to sleep, and really a lot of morbidities associated with them. Um, and the newer technology with endovenous ablation really changed and revolutionized how we treat veins. Patients are treated as an outpatient, it's done in the office, and really it's just allowed us to treat patients where they can actually ambulate right after surgery. Um, what's interesting is you know, the, the laser technology has evolved quite a bit in the last 10 years or so it used to be primarily we used a 10 nanometer um, technology but now we really expanded and included um, lasers like 1320 that really targets water and it's a much better target for what we want to treat um, and there's some newer technology including steam and other things um, but I think what's wonderful about this is really it's allowed us to move this procedure from an operative um, base to really an, an in-office procedure that allows patients much better results with much less downtime. Yeah, I think the biggest thing is really the downtime and then also the complications. Um, traditional therapy, painful, um, you know, patients were really taking days and weeks before they could recover from it. And now we're really only targeting the vessel of interest. You get much better efficacy, um, there's much lower recurrence rate, and really patients walk into the office and they can go back to their daily activity. So we've really changed how the approach of varicose veins is. Um, I think the biggest thing is the number of patients we can treat. It used to be when patients come into the office with varicose veins, we would tell them, you know, wait until it's the worst it could possibly be before you get treatment. Because really, ligation and stripping was something that we wouldn't want to do unless someone really, really needed it. And now we're able to treat patients much earlier on. Remember with varicose veins, it's a huge range of, range of patients with severe disease, including edema, um, you know, and, and ulcers. And we can actually target these patients and treat them before they get, you know, as bad as that. And really just changing their lives and basically improving them because we're allowing them to be treated much earlier than we used to.